Okay, this is a, a concept map, uh, the free software concept map. Uh, now it's, uh, you can find it, oh, you will not say that. Uh, it's in esgenu.org, and it will be in genu.org soon. So I am the maintainer, and this is useful for teachers. Uh, usually when you make a didactical unit, you need to prepare uh, what, uh, what things will you explain, um, what must be first, what second, the timing, the difficulty, the lot of details. So this helps pre uh, teachers to make, to prepare everything, okay? Uh, it's free, it will be in Debian, like a package, so that's it. Okay. Huh? Oh, now it's translated to 23 languages, and it was uh, and the uh, contraportada in English. Well, the back part of a publication made uh, UNESCO, so I was happy. Okay. Thanks. Okay, anyone else with buff results, for example? Um, great, no volunteers. Um, then Enrico will talk another thing or two. One. So, terminal somewhere. No, I don't want to send mail to people. Okay. Um, hello, uh, again. Um, uh, the, take advantage of the opportunity to show you something that you have in your computer, but you probably haven't noticed, which is this. Um, Fine, okay, excellent. Um, which is this directory? You are likely to have this directory in your computer, which contains um, contains a strange index of stuff that you never noticed you have. Um, it's built by something called the apt Xapian index. Uh, it's built every week uh, in Chrome and by a script called update apt Xapian index. It, um, it is another index just like apt, but it complements apt for all the higher level user interface tasks. There's not many things that use it yet, although synaptics, uh, who of you uses synaptics? The graphical package manager? No, it is not. Uh, but it's a ship. Um, if you use the synaptics, you would have noticed that as of recently, um, there's a new search box that if you type something like a name of package or keyword, automatically and super quickly as you type, you have results. And which is quite pleasant, but how does it work? Using this index. This index is based on uh, Xapian which is a full text index, and uh, it indexes pretty much everything. Um, as you can see, there are several plugins that add information at during the indexing process. And so we have depth text, tra descriptions, translated descriptions, package size. Uh, 
more stuff can be added if we have more information sources, for example popcorn. It's trivial to add it to that index, the issue is uh, downloading the data in the system regularly. Uh, this index can easily support uh, such little things as while you are typing generate a tag cloud of what uh, related to what well I'll show you right um, if I find a browser in the mess I'll open a new one the messy desktop is fine because you add stuff on top all the time Okay, this is a simple prototype written in JavaScript uh, that you queries like uh, it's a demo for another servery thing that I created that uses AppXAP in this backend, but you don't need JavaScript or a web server to use it. The data, the index is there and you can access it. And as you type, say I type image and I have completions suggestions for further related keywords I could uh, which I okay I clicked and uh, they show up uh, I can have spell checking this is a tag cloud related to what I'm searching and these are packages sorted by relevance I can add popcorn information and they sh and they can also be sorted by popularity this is used for example by go play who shows all games and you can search over here and the result of the search change right away as you type not only but the the possible tags change as you type this list becomes smaller or bigger um, or bigger still as you type GoPlay is also nice, it shows package screenshots and uh, and other things. So basically we have an index over there, how do you query it? For those who care about Debian Planet, um, I even had tags for it. In my blog there was a whole big series about introducing it with all sort of uh, um, with, a, with a series on you know performing a simple query and then on um, add simple result filters to the query and then you go on with suggesting new terms for improving the query searching for similar packages and the blog series goes on Ad cut off according to quality pack to quality of the results smart way of querying tags search as you type dynamic tag cloud so all the code is there uh, I'm not writing a super advanced feature killer application package manager because I'm the person who wrote the back end and I will end up doing an interface that looks like the index which is not what should be done but if any of you feels fancy about making a nice interface to search for packages like new generation web 3.0 sort of kind of mashup uh, modern 2009 fancy 3d feature full uh, all the back end is doable you only have to provide the interface it's been there for several months maybe one year um, I'm j it's just a reminder, do something about it or I feel useless having made it. <laughs>